Hi there, welcome back to Racing Retro. In this episode, we've been invited to the Bonhams Bike Auction at the Stafford Classic Bike Show. So we're gonna have a look round and see what catches our eye. Yeah, and then we're also gonna pick a handful of bikes and play the prices right, so. Good guy. <laughs> the worst Jim Bone impression I've ever heard. No, Brucey, you Brucey. is right. Oh, anyway, so we're gonna pick a handful of bikes, we're gonna have a guess at the guy price, we're gonna think what we, what we think they're gonna go for, and then whoever gets it closest is obviously yeah. the most cleverest, which is obviously me. Um, so let's go in and have a look, as yeah. long as we're not MV accredited cheap. Let's go see if there's a katana in there. Oh, the katana. katana. <laughs> katana. You prefer to go on? Katana or Sam Fox? <laughs> Head straight for these race bikes, I think. Yeah, definitely. I think we start with this. Bimota, Bimota. Yeah, Bimota. Come on, Ant. All right, let's bore, go have a look. Bore me with details about <laughs> this. Okay, so here we've got a Bimota SB8K. Um, they've got a TL1000 engine in, which you ate TLs, terrible don't you? Terrible engine. Yeah, terrible. Second gear. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so Anthony Gobert rode this uh, in World Superbikes. Uh, the year 2000, I think it was. He actually won a race on it at Phillip Island. Uh, it was in the wet race, and it was Bermuda's first race back since, I don't know, like late 80s, early 90s, whatever. Um, and it was the first race win that they had since uh, Gia Giacarlo uh, Falafa from, and Paul Ricard. Mate, honestly, I've no idea how you know all this <laughs> stuff. How do you know all this stuff? Just... A, a bit of an anorak. Start but yeah, say so it was a, a V-twin, it was a Suzuki engine. Um, do you know on, on Bermotors, you can tell what sort of engine they run? It's because like the first letter on the model. So the S, Suzuki, oh, so B. B5 was the Yamaha. Yeah, B, BMW. So. They, what, they did a BB? Yeah, the latest yeah. one, the, the one the, with the new BMW motor yeah. in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. a BB? Yeah. Is it really? Yeah, the one that our mate Ben Wiley rode. So. Nice. Yeah, it's nice. It's, yeah. So yeah, it looks it nice, is nice, isn't it? But I, d yeah. I don't know, what, what do you reckon price? Oh, actually, yeah, we what's the guide price for this? I don't know, I'll have a quick look now. Anthony Gobert was a bit, if you didn't know who he was, he was an Australian superbike racer. Yeah, and he was a bit of a, a bit of a character. He, uh, he pissed in Neil Hodgson's helmet once. Was not while he's wearing it. Not while he's wearing it, because yeah, that, yeah. be <laughs> that would be a... That would be a... Yeah, um, and he was a bit, you know, Bit of a party boy, bit the go show it, they call yeah, him, the go show. I mean, he's very yeah. sort of like sideways raw. on the Kawasaki's and all that, yeah, is yeah. That and then he did a lot of uh, AM, is it AMA Superbike, the American series for Vance and Heinz Ducati? But uh, yeah, probably right then. had a lot of um talent but just wasted it a bit, really. But, but anyway, yeah, so similar to me. Um, what's the guide price? I'm gonna, do you want okay. me to have a so, guess so, on the guide price? Yeah, so the guide price, price is 165,000. The guide price is 115 to 135,000 pounds. All right then. So, what are we saying? Uh, yeah, I... 115 I, to 135, go on, yeah. you go first. I mean, it's, there's, there's, there's not many of them, is it? You can buy a, a few Ducatis, couldn't you, or that have been super bad, but motors are just, there was just the one, wasn't it? Or probably the other spare bikes, so there might be two of these about. I'm, I'm, I don't think it's gonna make the I don't think it's gonna, I, I don't think it is. I'm gonna go. Go on then. 120. 120 I'm going for. I'm gonna go for, I'm gonna go for less than it's, are you I'm go, gonna are you go going even, for 110. 110, right. And if, yeah, 110. Yeah. Keith? <laughs> I'm gonna go under again. Are you going under? I'm going at 105. 105. So Keith's 105. 105. 110. 110. 120. I'll tell you what, though. Smell this. Pure race fuel. Smell that. How nice is that? Oh, yes. That, that's sweet, that is. I would have thought that would have been drained then, wouldn't it? Like, 
Yeah. All right, come on. All right, then. Right. What have we got here? Let's have a look. Are we in? I'm going to tell you all about this bike. You're so, going to yeah, tell yeah. me. I'm going to tell you about this. Okay. It's Troy Bayliss's. You sure? Yep. It's okay. a Ducati. And it was sponsored by Marlborough. The fag people. What number was it? 12. It's number 12. And he ran this in 2003. How's this staff? So, all right. Yeah, yeah. Against 2003 was the second year of the 990s. <laughs> I mean, it's, again, a thing of beauty, but agricultural in a way, isn't it? Bit of plumbing pipe. Nice though. Big, much bigger than I thought it'd be. Big machine. They're big, aren't they? I always thought race bikes would be tiny. This Kicked out a lot of heat as well, apparently. That was just, yeah. It's brutal, isn't it? Yeah, brutal. But like you said, very raw. Very raw, because, yeah. Because, say, where the Hondas were using the electro start to use electronics aids like traction control and stuff, this yeah. was just none of that, just a quick shifter. Nice, though, eh? She's a beauty, isn't she? So, so what do you reckon it's going to go for? Uh, is do, it you know, do you know the guy? No, I don't. Sure. I have no idea. So you still don't know the guy? I still don't know. I've not cheated. Is it more or less than what I'm thinking? I don't know what you're thinking. Well, you do. You'll know what I'm thinking. I'm thinking, so is it, I'm thinking is it more or less than that? I think it's obviously more because nobody knows who Anthony Gobert is, do they? <laughs> Gobert. Gobert. What's his name? Gobert. Anthony Gobert, yeah. Gobert. Anthony Gobert. Oh, you didn't know, Keith didn't know who he was. No, yeah. one, no one knows who he is. Your guide price. That's, I'm thinking the guide price that is 165-ish, 100, somewhere around right. there. Yep, okay, so. The guide price is? I was a little off. Yeah, that. Is it 300,000 mm, yeah. high price? Is it? 200? 270. Yeah. 70. Yeah. 70. Yeah. Yeah. I, I think it's going to sell. And I think it's going to sell for. Mm. 240. If there's, a, if there's no reserve, 240. Yeah, I don't know if there's a reserve. I'm well, probably. I think I think the bidding will end at 240. Yeah. So and I'm basing that on that Proton KR thing. It was for sale for years, it still is. Oh, right. Right. 240. That's a lot of chunk of change, though. So it is, yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm going go, to go higher. Oh. I'm going to go with 260. 260? So you're going 240, 240 260. Yeah. 260. Just because it's rare. I'm basing all this on the cost of living crisis, so if you <laughs> go for more than oh, that. Oh, £2.40. Yeah. yeah. Then it's all made up. What cost of living crisis? I'm on holiday next week. Go on, I'm uh, I'll go. I'll go 300. I'm just going for it. I'm going, I'll go really? for the high price, yeah. Because just oh. they don't come, like I said, they don't come. £60,000 swing, and I guess. It's yeah. I'm good at maths. Right. Okay. Right. Good well, maths. Make a note of that and uh, note. Right. Right. We'll see what else is about. Right. Excellent. Let's go and have a look. I haven't seen your katana yet, mate. Now this is a row that I'm interested in. What's catching your eye straight well, off? It's all right. Now these, I like these. Is that RD125? RD125, yeah. What's guy price on these? Then? About four and a half, are they? Four and a half, five grand, aren't they, on these? If I remember right. These are like a genuine indicators on. No, it's beautiful, isn't it? Original exhaust, no microns on. Proper they are. Aren't they? <coughs> 20 horsepower. Are we having a guess on these then? So what they'll sell for? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, Let's okay. pick the red and white one because it's um, cleaner, isn't it? Four, what was the guide on that? Four to five. 31,000 miles. What's that one done? 31. So this is on 31, yeah. I'm going five and a half. Because I think these are very collectible at the minute. I'm From going my age group. Oh, you know. I'm going to go 4,000. 400. Ooh. Very precise. Mm. I've got a 50p on. I was going to go four and a half, but I don't know if I can now, if that's 100 pounds. No, you can go if you want to do that, it's no yeah, bother. I'll stick with that, four, four, five, and half. four five then. Cheat. <laughs> You're See, 40. I like, I like this as well, I like this. Do you? Yeah, something I mean, about I the prefer old, this and that other Something thing about the old trials bikes that, that, that do it for me, to be honest. 
Yeah. I think it's the evil can kind of evil. But this is right up your street, isn't it, mate? This, no. This is where you're at. This is the sort of it's, thing the police would have followed me on. It's a turbo. Because it says, it, why does it say it backwards? So you can, in your rear view mirror. Rear view mirror. You can, you you know, can tell you're, you're, just, be, you're just about to be done by a turbo. By a policeman a on CX a turbo. A CX 650 turbo. I mean, I love the colour. That's pretty cool. Yeah. It's yeah. a horrendous bike, though, isn't it? It's, it's up there with a the guitar, isn't it? to be fair, it is, isn't it? That is dreadful, isn't it? It is dreadful, yeah. I mean, look at its face. Look. But now we're talking, back over here. Now we're talking. The RG. Yeah. What a nice bike. You're not a fan, are you, Dom? How can you not be a fan of that? I don't. That's like the oh, first no. proper he said super that. bike. He said that it? to stitch me up. I, what do you think? I didn't say I wasn't a fan. No, I, I quite like. I think. Do you prefer the Yamaha or the RD? No, no, absolutely not. No. I've had to choose like one. Just of none them. of the 500s. Are. Not really. Right, this. Guide price on this. Go yep. for it. Right. Six to nine thousand. Six to nine. Wow. I reckon a really clean one of these. I would think. Fetch. Yeah, the clean one would fetch north of that, wouldn't it? Yeah. So it's six to twelve. Six to nine. Six to nine. Mm. Um, Who's, you'll go first this time, mate. It's, it's a bit tired. Yeah. If we're mm. honest. I'm, I'm going to say six. And these tires. Six are three. Death. Six what? I'm going to say six three. It's you, isn't it? Is it? Is it you? Five seven. Is that? Five seven fifty. Five seven. Yeah. Five seven. Mm. Yeah. What did you say? Six three. Six three, yeah. So I think I'm going to go slightly north of that. I think six five. Do you know none of us, none of us have gone above the guide price yet? No. Some of them, and they usually do go way above, don't they? Like, but I just, I don't know. No, I don't I mean just think it was a bit. It is a bit tired, isn't tired it? It needs a bit of work doing it. Look at these. I just made that it. it's the uh, ART Aprilia. Paul Bird Motorsport. I mean that. Pretty cool, that, that is. is a thing of beauty, isn't it? Look at that. Is that the exhaust on it? Sexual, isn't it? From the that CRT here, isn't that it? That GP. That is. That's nice, isn't it? It's a lovely colour green. It, it is a lovely colour green. It suits it, doesn't it? Mm. I had a post. I did have a post of, the, of a. Of a VFR so the, that was your favourite bike, no, was it? No, my favourite was a CBR 1000F. However, I did have a poster of one of these, and I think the poster was in three different colours. White, there was a big one, a white one, and then underneath it had the red one and the black one. They do a red one and a black one, didn't they? Yeah, yeah. I reckon the guide price on this is about eight quid. It's, it's the dullish bike here. Dullish bike there. Yeah. Right, go on. And do you know what it's the guy price is? I know, but you're only riding this if you've got a moustache. Do you know what the guy price is on this? Two grand. You're saying two grand. What are you saying? Uh, the guy price. Uh, you know it. You've read it. Fifteen hundred quid. Fifteen hundred to what? Two grand. Oh, there you go. I was right as well there. Yeah. Ooh, Prillia one two five. Where? Just yeah. to Keith's oh, left. Oh yeah, to Keith's left, yeah. Has this got like... No miles. No miles, on it? Yeah. Two, oh, two. Two miles. Two miles. That's probably just being pushed around. Yeah. I think... That is mental. That's one of my favourites. It's not as nice as the yeah, earlier I, I, I Yeah, I think... Uh, no, I did like that one, because it looked very much like the 250 and yeah, 125 this Grand Prix racer, but... Mm. Uh, not that colour scheme, I think no. I like that. It's a rare colour scheme, is it? Yeah. I don't know, I've not really seen one that colour. No. However, not as nice as the Sport Pro. Oh, yes, yeah, The yeah. one that yes. preceded it. Yes, yeah. Oh, no, I didn't, I think I preferred oh, really? that one, Over yeah. The, no. Because it did just look like the, it just looks like the RSW 250, doesn't it? Do you reckon that'll sell? I reckon that'll sell. Well, the guy price, I six already know. Six to eight. Six to eight thousand pounds. The, I, don't, I, just I, don't, don't, I can't see you doing see the, the, the highest price of that. We're still not going above it, are we? <laughs> no. No, cost of living crisis. 5.3. 5.300. So you're going 5.300. What's that? Sorry, Keith? 5.6. Yeah, you're not focused at that. 5. <laughs> 5.6. 5.6. Uh, what did you say? 5.3? 5.3. I can go 5 on the nose. I thought five? I was going to go in the middle then. I and mean, be a bell Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Five on, Five the on the nose. Right then. But I nice to see a zero miler. Now these, these, I mean, 
Oh, what a I miss mine. the exhaust on that. So you had one of these, Keith, yeah? I did, yeah. What happened to that? You get that off. Uh, I sold you it too it. cheap, mate. Did you? That's what I did. Well, you say you sold it too cheap. Yeah, I, I say that. I yeah. think these would go for more. What the guy price on this is like about 1500 quid. quid. Yeah. And saying that, this is I a sold. Nice looking motorbike. Yeah. yeah. I sold mine in, in my opinion. roughly about, I'd say, 15 years ago mm -hmm. for 1800 quid then. Well, you've. You sold at the right time. How many miles has this got? Is it 35. 35, that's in a lot of miles. It's got an absolutely god awful exhaust on it. It does. <laughs> it? I reckon, I reckon this is. I reckon this is going to be the cheapest one going. And look at the oil filler. Horrible, isn't it? Horrible. It's horrible. It's horrible. But this is a nice looking bike. 1500 quid. I bargain. think it's a bargain. Yeah. I think it's a bargain. I think these are too cheap, to be fair, for what they are. I love mine. Stuck to the road like glue. You know, it was. Yeah. See, a lot of people are buying them up now and making them into like track bikes, aren't they? Mm. 750 yeah. track bikes. You know, I like mean, if it was that nice one, you know, that they, they do a an RR, did they? An RR, yeah. yeah. With the no back seat on, yeah, that yeah. was the nice one, wasn't it? Yeah, and then the ZXR 750, like... Maybe SPS. that's the one. I think that's... In the With red, the round headlights? Yeah, that one. and was it like, had a bit of green, white and red? <sighs> on the that's R7. That's the best colour, that yeah. is, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. So maybe this is 1,500 quid then. Are well, we going to guess on it? Go on, I'll go, I'll, I'll go first on this. Go on, I'm going 1750. 1750. Because I think anyone would pay 1750 for a cheap run around bike. It's a usable daily machine, isn't it? At 1700 quid it is. What are you going for now? What's the guy? 15 to 2. Yeah. I'm going to. Do you know what? I'm going to say it's going to go. It's my first one that's going above the guide price. Oh, yeah? I'm going to go 2 2. £2,200. Yeah. I think, yeah. I'm going to go 2 8. 2 8? Yeah. Wow. What did you go for? 17. What the hell? 2 8? Really? Oh. I think, yeah, I think some. You can see them on eBay cheaper than that. <laughs> oh, are they? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Should we buy it and sell it? Him? Oh, yeah. How did you get to buying one of them after being falling in love with Katanas? No, I was on an R6 first, wasn't I? On an R6 and I, left, I jumped off the R6 onto one of these. Right. The simple fact that it was just, it was just lovely. It was just, I do like just a lovely bike. It's cheap. Oh shit, now I keep walking <laughs> yeah. into bikes, I do. So, oh. Ooh, now then, what have we got here? These are nice. Yeah. They're clean, aren't they? Yes. That one especially. This is amazing thing isn't it this is still the nicest one with these oh that had holes in as well but with the round headlights the round headlights yeah is that the first yeah no yeah yeah that's, yeah. yeah yeah that was second. not the right yeah. color though is it i think it was a rare color wasn't it was that? it oh, was no. the, there wasn't many of the black ones but yeah got, it I'd, is beautiful I'd, that though i'd it? have the white purple one i think that's i think it was the like the yeah. classic see at the time mate look here they were already thinking about the fox eye look, see? That little so indentation um, there. I wonder if they were already thinking about that back then. But yeah. I think, like, you sort of modern day classic, these are the sort of bikes. If you've got these knocking about in a in a barn or whatever. That's no, I, I would think this would be worth some. Yeah, I, this, I think money. this is it. These are the, the sort of ones that you want low mileage. Original this this is low yeah. mileage. This has got six on it. It's not got six. Was it saying the the guy in the? Oh, you have to read it, though. You know what I mean. You pull up outside a bike meet. No one's going to laugh more, at you. More attention. Yeah, no one's going to laugh yeah, at you. I think yeah, there's more people come and have a look at this than you. Yeah. Modern day five. Old joke on the top here. Doesn't I it? love that. It's mental, isn't it? Yeah. Help me, help me find it, Keith. Struggling, mate. Are you struggling? Yeah. I found the other one. Not oh, yeah. these two. You found <coughs> it straight away. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck's sake. How much? Get your thumbs over it. Nine to ten, five to six. Wow. Five to so six. This is five to six. This is nine to ten. So is it original? Uh, oh, that's six what miles. We're working, we? No. Only two miles have been covered since the restoration completion. Oh, so it's had new clocks on it. Probably had new clocks on it, hasn't it, that, yeah. Right, yeah. Because there's, there's marks on there that show where of the key. Hmm. Yeah. And look, so if you look at nine the, to ten. The nine to ten thousand. 
But how many miles has it got on the clock? It could have 102. We don't, we don't know, know, do we? No. For, for that, off, that'll then. put people off, I yeah. would have thought, definitely. It's It'd be better off having better off having that one. miles, wouldn't it? Yeah. yeah. How many's that one got on it? 22. So you're better off having that. At least you know what it's done. And that was what, going for four? four five to six. Five to six, that one. Nine to Are ten. we going to guess on this? So Which what, one? I'm saying Gen 1 Fireblade first? Yeah. Gen 1 Fireblade, so might go first? Yeah. I'm going, I think it's low this, I'm going seven and a half. Just for that simple reason, we don't know what it's done. It's beautiful and everything, but... I don't know if it's the right colour. Mm, exactly. But nine to ten, someone must know. I'm going to go eight, nine. Eight, nine? Yeah. I think it'll get somewhere near. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to go eight, five then. In the middle. Yeah, again. <laughs> <One> go. <laughs> and right. this one, are we going yeah, gen nice. two as well? No one wants them, do they? No one wants them. I don't know, I think it's quite cool. Right. It's quite nice, isn't it? Well, if we're going on that one, we also got that one. What was that, four and a half? Five to six, on it? Five to six. See, I think that'll fetch five and a half. Yeah. Mm. Five and a half for Keith. Five one. What, five and a half? Five thousand one hundred, I think. Five thousand one hundred, what did you go for? Five and a half. Five and a half. Five and a half. I'll go six. Six? Yeah. It's done 45,000 miles then. Okay, yeah, I know. No, too, late, too late, change, late, change, no. Late, change <laughs> late, Too late, too late. Too late. How are we going next? What has it done? 22,000. <laughs> don't know, I didn't look. So, yeah. yeah, didn't look, did you? Everything up here is as old as Keith, so shall we... Uh, zero I, miles on yeah, seven. I'd say this is... Is that what it is? Is it a zero miles, zero is miles it? Zero miles on seven. Unregistered. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. There we go. Not been had its uh, under tray hacked off. That's a nice looking bike. Well. Isn't it? They're just timeless, aren't they? So what's the guy price on this then? Does anybody know the guy price on this? Do you know I it? I think is it sixty? Is it? Is it sixty? Wow, sixty k. So. Right then. Here's a question. Race bikes aside, because everyone's going to take either that Ducati or Paul Birds. Oh, I'd, no, I'd take this. I think mean, this is the, the showstopper, I think. This? Yeah. Out of all the bikes? Mm. It's because it's zero miles. Really? But looks wise, yeah. I'd take the Duke behind it, out of these two. Oh, which is the prettiest one? I'd take the Duke. I know yeah, it's nice. I, I think it's awesome. Well, that seven, looks better. They? They're both nice, aren't they? They're both nice. Different to you, though, aren't they? Yeah, look at the difference, though. Put a number six on that and a number one on that. You're not going to tell me it's going to look like an R1 or an R6, are you? You're not saying that. To the... To the blind man. To the blind man, To the yeah. blind man. <laughs> it doesn't look like an R6. It doesn't. No. No. It's not far off, then. Oh, it is. It's miles <laughs> off. Look at the tank on it. And look at the headlights. I love the headlights on them. They were just... Oh, so cute. Look. Yeah. No, it's in it. But, you know, you're right. I think with Ducati. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Anyway, we've got, to have a, we've got to have a sniff on this. Yeah. We have, haven't we? So what's the, what's the guide on this, then? Right, then. Guide price on this. 35 to 45 for this. 35 to 45. Yeah. See, and that this, seems... 35 to 45. Yeah, okay. and this is the same. 35 to 45. 40 to 45, mm. so roughly so about 40 grand a piece. OK, so got... starting with the R7, then, what do you think? <sighs> Remembering it's, it's got nice. a Delta Box 2 for it. Delta Box 2, <laughs> that's, that's chucked a couple of Loosely grand on based it. Loosely based on it, yeah. Uh, well, and the guy price is what? Roughly about 40? 40. Both, let's say 40 for them both. Mm. R7, I'm going to go 46. 46? Oh, I think that's, that's good. Mm. Mm. I think. But we've seen one sat around for 50 grand for a long time. It's not as nice as that, though. No, it isn't. No, it isn't. 47. Oh, you, Belland. <laughs> right, Wait a minute, 46 and a half. <laughs> um, well, I think um, one recently sold at Iconic Motorcycles for... Oh, he's um, done it again, hasn't he? Yeah, yeah. He's done it again. For $53,000. Oh, it's dollars. dollars $46,000. 46, 46 and a half. And that had three and a half thousand miles on it. Uh, if only we'd done our homework, like, oh. teach us pet it, <laughs> we would have known, wouldn't we? 
so I I get, I'm going to say fifty. Oh, 50. Yeah. So moving on. Just to moving on uh, to this. See, I like this. It is. Nice. See, I've not done any research about what I these mean, go for. They've both got very nice swinging arms. Yeah. Mm. I've not done any research on this, so I don't, I don't know. Guy price forty grand. I'm going to say more. I'll go first on this. Yeah. Go I'm going to say this will sell for forty. Eight thousand oh, pounds. That's what I was going for. Oh, of course you were. You're not going to go for that. You were going to say twelve pounds. You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna go under. I'm gonna go forty-six on this one as well. So forty-six. Yeah. Forty-eight. 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 Yeah. I'm gonna go fifty-one. Oh yeah. That's because probably he's looked up and the last one that yeah, sold last week. Yeah, because an iconic. Uh, yeah, yeah, there was one that went. Was it? <laughs> no, <I don't> know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Right. So, okay, yeah. once the auction's complete, we'll do a little follow-up video, find out who's closest to the mark. Yeah. Point for every, point for the closest one. Find out who's the cleverest bike person. <laughs> What's the uh, the wooden spoon prize? Mm. Got any ideas? No, for we've it? got no ideas yet. Yeah. No, That's absolutely it. no ideas. Yeah. But However. If it's something to do with Keith, it would be something about dressing up and acting on it. It should be no wooden spoon because he enjoys it. <laughs> Depends where the spoon goes. So, on that note. See you next Tuesday. Or we'll be finished. <laughs> we're finished. I don't know. We're off now. <laughs> we're finished now. Just wrapped it up. Just wrapped it up. <laughs> <laughs> well, are we wrapping it up? Yeah, no, that's probably a good point. Wrap it up.